Topo Wire is a spline generator plug-in for creating wire connections that can be instantly turned into dynamic splines. After installing, you will find it under Plugins menu. To get started, you simply have to make the desired geometry, a child of Topo Wire, and it's ready to render. The distribution type has two options. By default, Topo Wire randomly distributes splines across the geometry, based on points count. Its slider is limited to a value of 1000. However, you can go much higher, without losing any performance. The position of these points can be redistributed, by altering its random seed value. When the distribution option is set to vertex mode, the position of spline points will correlate to the vertices of the base geometry. If you will create multiple duplicates of the base object, spline points will be distributed across the entire hierarchy. As you can see, all the children of Topo Wire Generator are hidden by default. You can expose them in your scene by enabling the Return Hierarchy option. Distance Limit is self-explanatory. When these options are enabled, very short and too long splines will be removed. When disabled, no limit will take place. You can also limit the number of distributed spline points, based on falloff deformer, which can be used, after executing the create command. The hanging wires effect can be achieved, by decreasing the curvature option. Some points that are distributed on a single object, will result in self-hanging wires. These short splines can be removed, by enabling the minimum distance option. If you look closer, you'll notice that some parts of this spline, are intersecting your geometry. This is because the connection points are generated directly onto the surface. We can easily move all points to the center of the base mesh by decreasing the direction value. Splines coordinates on a y-axis can be changed by altering the position value. Thickness option generates polygonal object based on the topo wire splines. Radius option is self-explanatory. It simply alters an overall thickness of generated geometry, while the scale option allows us using the spline graph to adjust the diameter of the topo wire. It is worth mentioning that this effect propagates along its entire length. If you need to affect each individual segment separately, you have to disable the close spline option. Topo wire object will efficiently work with particle modifiers after executing the generate dynamic spline command. This action creates a new spline, based on a previous setup, and now you are able to apply all forces of dynamics. If further manipulations are necessary, you'll have to delete this newly created spline, and perform the desired adjustments. 
it is worth mentioning that an overall quality of your simulation will be improved by increasing the number of spline interpolation points. Topo wire is capable of detecting which render engine is activated, so it will instantly optimize and convert all its settings by double-clicking on its icon. If you will create a new topo wire object, its settings will correlate to an appropriate render engine.